Hello and welcome to A2 Academy. This is the fourth video for our general science series for EPF examination. Uh, this video starts with the basic concept of acid, bases, and salts. You must have learned acid, bases, and salts up to 10th chemistry, and that's what uh, you need to revise for EPF examination. Acids. Acids are substances that release H positive ions when dissolved in water. Bases are substances that release hydroxide ion. Hydroxide is OH negative ions when dissolved in water. And salt are ionic compounds when acids and bases react with each other. Salts are formed. Hydrogen ions of an acid are replaced by metal ions. Let's see acid, bases and salts separately and in detail. Acids, uh, the word is derived from Latin word acidus, which means sour. So generally, uh, when you say you have acidity, you feel a soury feeling in your gut, right? Uh, acids are sour tasting, tasting chemicals. Uh, they have a pH less than 7. What is pH? We'll discuss in the further video. Sour flavors can be found in uh, example of lemon juice, tomatoes, vinegar, et, uh, vinegar etc. Uh, so, in common household items which taste a little tangy, little sour, it is possible that they have acids in them. Organic acids are acids found in both plants and mammals. Mineral acids are organic acids from, from earth's mineral. Acids contain a lot of hydrogen ions and the amount of hydrogen ions released when an acid reacts with water tells us how strong that, an, that acid is. Second, we have bases. Bases are chemical compounds that have harsh taste. Okay, so basically you don't taste them. They are not found in uh, food items commonly. Uh, any material that may neutralize acid is referred to as base. So, any material which can change the taste of an acid is base. This will have a pH of more than 7 because acid had less than 7. So, bases naturally have more than 7. 7. Sodium hydroxide, magnesium hydroxide, calcium hydroxide. So see, all hydroxides. Why? Because they release hydroxide ions. Alkalis include sodium hydroxide, potassium hydroxide. Um, uh, we have done periodic table. So we did the uh, alkali metals. So all the bases formed by those alkali metals will be represented as alkali bases. Base is a material that dissolves in water and produces OH negative ions. Now we have salt. If I combine acid and base, then they form a reaction which forms salt. In this, the metal, uh, the acid is substituted by the metal. Okay. The salts are formed when acid reacts with foundation. pH of a salt is generally around 7 because a strong base reacts with a strong acid okay then it forms a salt so ph will be neutralized generally but it is possible that acid is much stronger than base then it would result in a uh, salt less than 7 ph if base is stronger than a little uh, more than 7 ph uh, the most common salt we know is common salt table salt that is sodium chloride NaNCl sometimes known as uh, table salt also as i told you the act of deciding whether or not a person is responsible So, we have different concepts of salt also, okay. Uh, the most common concept that can come in your exam is Lewis concept of acids and bases. An acid is a substance which can accept an electron, okay. So, acid will accept an electron. Why? Because it releases positive ions, right. So, it can accept an electron like boron fluoride and carbon dioxide. The base is a substance which can produce an electron. So, if I am ex if I have a compound that can accept an electron and it ha if I have a compound that can produce an electron naturally I can react these two and form a salt and in the process of salt forming water is generally formed. What is the pH scale? pH scale is an important measure of acidity or basicity of an aqueous solution. Okay. Uh, if uh, the pH value is less than 7, it is considered acidic and if it is greater than 7, then it is considered basic. If it is 7, it is considered neutral. That should be the idealistic value of your drinking water. See here, here you have a scale of acid. 
the red color represents asset the blue color represents basic okay uh, you see battery asset the uh, used in your cars gastric acid produced by your stomachs lemon juice you all know wine rain water these all are acidic in nature milk even milk but distilled water is neutral it has a ph of 7 then ocean water baking soda ammonia solution chlorine bleach and clean drainer cleaner are all basic in nature common acids which are found in our everyday food products are here as follows you know acetic acid is nothing but vinegar formic acid is found in red ants the red ant bites which leaves a red rash on your body is formic acid HCOOH the simplest acid, simplest acid citric acid is found in citrus fruits citrus fruits are lemon uh, oranges maltas etc then you have lactic acid lacto lactic word is related to milk so this acid is present in curd then you have ascorbic acid ascorbic acid is present in amla tartaric acid is present in grapes and ripe mangoes oxalic acid is present in spinach then you have some common acids which are present in uh, your uh, fruits fruits and vegetables okay so uh, citrus acid contains citric acid as i just told you malic acid is present in apples tomatoes pomegranates etc ascorbic acid is also known as vitamin c so uh, anything that has vitamin c will have ascorbic acid uh, tartaric acid can be found in apples apricots bananas tamarind etc tamarind is nothing or imli uh, tartaric acid malic acid and acetic acid are all examples of natural dietary acids they are used to control weight and uh, you might have seen many people recommending these things or like eat oranges or eat tomatoes uh, tomatoes as your diet why do they do so because these contain these acids and these are called dietary acids then uh, you have buffer solutions now what is a buffer solution buffer solution are those solutions which can withstand a ph caused by addition of a small acid or base so for example i have a buffer solution and i add an acid okay so normally a solution should, should become acidic right so, so on a ph scale it will move towards uh, left side but if it's a buffer solution the ph scale won't move basic buffer has a ph higher than 7 acidic buffer has a ph less than 7 despite the fact we all eat all a lot of acidic meals ph of our blood is kept stable with the help of h2co3 hco3 buffer so our blood is a buffer solution and we eat so much of uh, acidic food but it uh, but it doesn't changes the flavor of our blood if i say in a layman language it doesn't change the flavor of our blood that's because our uh, blood is a h2co3 hco3 buffer which can withstand acids so stay connected follow us on uh, instagram twitter and telegram for more content and for uh, the pdfs and previous year questions